Hey guys, it's been a long time since I reviewed a ICS release for the Galaxy Ace. So, if I remember correctly, the last review I did was of the CyanogenMod Mod 9 Beta 4, which had made tremendous improvements over the releases. And uh, I actually skipped out a lot of versions, that is, um, up to the version we are at now that is the nightly which was released after the beta 8 so that's a lot of improvements and now I shall show you a quick preview and a review of the beta, uh, the nightly released uh, on 13 5 2012 so as you can see uh, this is the lock screen and uh, you can unlock and there's the camera button so this is the lock screen as I mentioned before and the normal trebuchet so here are the menus now let's get into the app drawer here are the apps so uh, I just installed this so these are the applications I'm running right now so you can swipe and uh, just get rid of them or you can go for the easy way and close it all at once so this is the app drawer the trebuchet which comes with the uh, normal android ics and uh, you, you have the widgets here so not much change from the previous versions you can take the widget and add it anywhere you want so that's a nice feature and then you have um, the most uh, amazing thing about this release that is the nightly release is that the settings have now been fully integrated the Sanjan more settings have been fully integrated that is you have the interface so you can theme it currently only one theme is installed and you have system settings in which you can even customize the lock screen you can uh, just um, sh uh, put a shortcut there that is uh, let's see browser okay then you will have the browser with the lock screen so let us give it a try save it and uh, let's try and see if that works yeah, so that works, but I don't think the uh, <laughs> the icon is displayed. I think there's no icon there. <laughs> there's something magnetic about it, but no icon there. So I don't know if that's a fault or it's meant to be like that. So we'll see the late the others. And uh, really, the main thing is the system integration. So these are the setups. You can uh, see my older review of uh, Beta 4. Pretty much everything else is the same, I believe. Uh, all the changes are in the internal environment. And yeah, one thing is that the YouTube player, YouTube is uh, supposedly uh, accelerated. There's no problem with that. The all the buttons and uh, all the connectivity options work uh, it has worked for me before I don't see a problem here and uh, you can see the Wi-Fi blue colored Wi-Fi button blue, blue, blue colored signal etc so I don't think there's there, there wasn't any problem for me Bluetooth is gray because well it is not connected so I think there's nothing more to it it's just another update for the beta for release uh, but still the main problem is the camera doesn't work let me show yeah can't connect to the camera yet and uh, well it hasn't been fully integrated and uh, there are bugs here and there I'm not going to get too deep into that and uh, I think that's pretty much it and yeah that's it so I hope you enjoyed the update 
I can't say this is a review or a first look because it's just an update. I think you enjoy. I hope you enjoy the update. And uh, if you liked, click the like button, favorite it, and uh, subscribe for more updates and reviews. Okay.